G'day Wacky Funsters. Today we are unboxing Moray Cup. This is a bottle of Moray Cup. Does Moray Cup have any specific warnings on it that you might need to keep in mind while you drink it? Warning, product of Scotland. <laughs> it's an ample warning. <laughs> Manufactured by Sangs Banff Limited Macduff. So that's quite delicious. Um, so let's have a look. But what, what, what is it? This is a, a lovely, um, a lovely label we've got here of two people, identical twins, I think, having an argument, drinking something that isn't Moray Cup by by the color of it. But I'm sure it's something very nice. Here's the also in a cornfield. In a cornfield. Saying they look like people who you would traditionally associate with a cornfield. I don't know. I would traditionally associate scarecrows with a cornfield and they don't look like that so so basically yeah it's a couple of anthropomorphic scarecrows drinking something that's not the drink that they're on the label of it might be once you pour it into the glass it might change color <laughs> magically yeah, could be all oh, right yeah let's um, see okay here we go oh it's very nice, pink nice big cup of moray <laughs> it's it's a lovely big cup of moray i didn't actually mean to pour that much but mm, i just did it sort of kept going waste don't waste it no, it's, no. How, how do you like the the way the bubbles are have you checked out the vintage Certainly. on the, the cap? The vintage, um, the vintage is um, S two sixteen oh six, twenty fifth of October. Illegible, so that's the year illegible. Uh, so it's a nice, yeah, illegible vintage Moro cup. Look. A very nice nose to it. Um. Sugary. I can't believe you drink this shit. Look how dark it looks at the bottom of the cup compared to the top of the cup. <laughs> I must admit, it doesn't look like the healthiest of concoctions, but a girl's got to do what a girl's got to do. It smells alright. It smells like red creamy soda, if you've ever had that. I think it's going to make a brilliant, um, a brilliant spider, a brilliant float. You know, where you get soft drink and you chuck some vanilla ice cream in and you drink that. That's what this is good for. I don't think it'll be good for drinking on its own, but we'll see. Yeah, that's red creamy soda. It's not bad. That tastes of unremarkable. <laughs> that soft drink, that's what that is. It's going to taste different when you get to the bottom as well. It probably will. I think there's possibly sediment in there. <laughs> That's how badass this this uh, little You're drink get a is. Up or a thumbs down? Um, I I I think a thumbs up from me. It's very generic, so, but it's good for what it is. So very generic and gone off, but good for what it is. Yeah. And uh, Moray Cup, thumbs up. So yeah, feed it to your children. Watch them climb the walls. Moray so Cup comes in <laughs> two litre bottles, uh, and is available in Asda in Edinburgh, and possibly nowhere else. And it contains the Sunset Yellow, and it may have an adverse effect on uh, activity and attention in children. So it's got it all, really. I would regard that as a plus. There's the barcode if you want to scan eBay to see if there's any auctions going on there. Mm. Okay, and it's produced by Sangs, mm. and uh, that was that was the unboxing kind of uh, review for Moray Cup. We'll finish this bottle off now, eh? Cheers, yeah. wacky fansters.